All right, this could be seaweed. I'm trying not to get my hopes up. All right, we got ourselves a pompano. Pompano! Yeah, it might be a keeper. We're gonna find out. It's got to be 11 inches to the fork. All right, he's 11 and a half to the fork. So that this is a keeper pompano. Yeah, keep it. No, I'm gonna let him go. He's he's a. There's not much. There's not much meat on that guy. He's a real skinny guy. I'll get him back though. Good morning guys, welcome back to the channel. I just pulled into Matanza's Inlet. There I am, just loaded the beach cart. My job is to walk all the way down this path right here on the ground here. And uh, we're gonna go underneath the Matanza's Bridge. And my mission today, I'm looking for Spanish mackerel. I forgot my wire leader, so this could be Little iffy if I'm gonna be able to pull these guys in or not. I don't know. 20 pound test. So they might bite through that, but I might be able to keep them hooked. I got a bunch of gotcha plugs. Um, also gonna be looking for pompano, whiting, and redfish. God, he spit the hook. I had him right there. Let's see if I can get him again. Didn't. Oh. Well, we are in a ladyfish. First catch of the morning. They like these gotcha plugs, man. I, ca I catch these at Matanza's frequently. There you go. Shake the hook off, baby. There you go. That's a little free tarpon ride right there. Woo. They like this little gotcha thing. It is, a, it is approaching like... Low tide, low, low tide. I've had to walk across this whole thing to get out here into the water and cast into this channel, the Mat Matanzas River. That is not my boat. This is Mike Bennett's boat. We're gonna go out on this one. Sorry about you, whoever boat this is. This really sucks. But we're taking his boat out, get out the house, go fish, and we're gonna go try to catch some fish. Yep, I told you, fish on, here we go. Swimming to me, flatty. Oh, he looks a little under though. That is definitely undersized flatty. Yes. Oh, there you go, yeah. He is slimy. See ya, buddy. In net for that, Mike? What do you think? Oh, it's a jack. Jack. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Get out the house, go fish. What'd you catch him on again? Real habit jig with a live shrimp, and he's grunting. Say hi to there. the people. Say hi. Say hi. <laughs> I'm sorry, I just hooked myself. Uh oh. All right. All right. No! Not the train. Oh, come on. On. Guys, good morning. I am running late. We've got a train rolling by, slowing me down even more. We got to catch some creek donkeys, okay? I'm going out with Captain Adam Morley this morning. We are, I'm doing something I've never done before, which is actually catch a redfish on top water lures. That is my mission. Uh, I'm running late. I'm running late. I, I play music for a living and I played pretty late last night and the sun is not even up yet. Okay. I'm trying to haul butt and get there. Of course I catch the train. All right. We made it. We made it. We made it. The boat's still in the marina. Hey, there he is. There he is right there. He's got his watch out. All right, let's go. on the top water. He 
show me how to do it. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, it spit the hook right there. It looked like a snook, too. Ah. There's a red. It was a red? Oh, okay. <clears throat> Dang, sir. Dang. All right, brand new rod. This is the Pen Battle Three, uh, Pen Battle th paired with the Pen Battle Three uh, reel, and the very first lure I've ever tied on is the Bone Creeper from Kiss My Fish. Their local company here in uh, these parts of St. Augustine and Jacksonville. And uh, we're we're back here in the back creeks. Adam and I are gonna. What are we What are we looking for today? A good time. A good time. I'm looking for redfish. <laughs> He's looking for a good time. <laughs> I wrote my number on the bathroom wall. <laughs> he called it. Still waiting for that good time. <laughs> Still waiting for the good time. Oh, shenanigans. Just looking for a hookup, you know. <laughs> shenanigans. Yeah, this is, there's some reds up in here. I'm using a fish bites curly too. Oh, right there. They're right there. Look, there's just there's a whole. There's like two or three of them right there. Yeah, I wouldn't. I guess our only shot is to get them before we spook them. We're doing plan B. We did not catch any fish, Adam and I. I had redfish all around us. We just could not catch a fish to save our lives. So we're gonna try a little surf fishing. We got Barry and Dustin down here. There's Barry straight ahead. BS surf fishing charters. That's our buddy Dustin. No, I did. I What's called up, you. What's up? How'd you guys do? Uh, we did terrible, but yeah. we, we found lots of fish, lots of bait. Could not hook up. No. Fish were all around us. All right, I got one rod. So maybe I can squeeze in somewhere. Squeeze in, man. Oh, Pompano. Oh, yeah, we got it. Dang, he just caught it. Wow, look, look at that beauty. All right. In the cooler. There we go. Fish on. How are you, sir? What's up? Good to see you. I'll, try, I'll try to squeeze in right here. Yep. Yeah. I need some more line on this. <laughs> what you got? Little lady. Oh man, that's a big lady. That's a senora. Harp and coming soon. Do we keep them? That's the question. I don't know. I'm not keeping it. You're on. Hey, no, 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 no. Man, it's a big one. <laughs> they all been big this year. And they all fight like pumping up. Yeah, they start running. Yep. You think you got a good pump on, but what you got is this guy. Actually, this is good to eat though. Are you taking it home or what? Nope. No. No? Alright. Well, I don't have my pliers. I got one here. 
yeah. It's the DSBS rig that where he's using. It's the sand flea. Catches a lot of fish. Barry, I showed up and uh, the catfish showed up. Uh, it could be my fault. I mean, Mike, I feel like this is a trend with me and you, buddy. I mean, well, you I'm, know what? I rolled up. He's catching pops. We're over here. I mean, I got one of the bucks. One of the bucks. Oh, you do? Yeah. Okay. So, so right. they're here. I mean, the water's getting a little dirty. We can see that out there, but it's definitely a, uh, hey, man, compared to what we were supposed to have today, I'll yeah. be out yeah. here any day. It's a blessing. Yeah. So, considering we're supposed to have thunderstorms all day. They don't know. No, man. They throw darts. Yeah, they don't know. The weather's great. Yeah, beautiful out today. Which saved us some beach real estate because if it said that the weather was good, uh, was good, it, this probably we wouldn't have enough room to fish here right now. No, not at all. No, no. we would be making making a walk for sure. Yeah, we actually pay the weathermen to say it's going to be crappy out so that we can come out. That's what we do. Pay hey, Adam that too, so that way when he tells everybody when they come in the shop, it's going to be a bad day. <laughs> Here we go. Let's keep going. <sighs> Gotta catch back up to it. There we go. He's still on. He's still on. Hello, oh, Papano coming in right in front of me. Dude, that sandbar knocked him off. No. See, there's a sandbar right here. As soon as he hits the sandbar, he hits it hard and then, then he just comes off. DS custom tackle, the mini mini rig kit. Yeah. Mini mini me. <laughs> Kinda looks like a like a sand flea, guys. Boom. Very cool. Two out circle hooks. There it is. That's the fastest I've ever seen Barry run. <laughs> this rod, we have yet to bring in a fish on this rod. We keep hooking up and it keeps coming off. I don't even want to jinx it. I don't want to say anything. I just, I'm just gonna watch this go down. We've lost, we've lost how many fish on this? Oh, he just lost it again. What is going on? There's something wrong with his sandbar. The way it comes off, the fish are just like getting dislodged off the hook something crazy right there must be like a a whoosh of a current or something he goes there he goes we're running we're running so we could trust this rod <laughs> yeah man i don't know this is it barry's on fire over the bar 13 footer here Barry's showing us how to do it today. He's a uh, surf fishing charter. So we are over this. No, we're over this line. Well, it's running like a catfish, so it must be a pompano. Ladyfish. It's a ladyfish. Way off. Big old ladyfish. That is a monster ladyfish. It broke me off. Sputnik's right there in the sand. Got it. Look at the size of this ladyfish. Yeah, that's that's Big Bertha right there. Yep. There's your uh, Sputnik Thanks, sinker guy, Sputnik there. Can't lose these. No, I think I think they're like fifty dollars each now. Now that we started this YouTube channel, we got bearded Brad, <laughs> surf hippie fishing. Dustin Dustin Berg, man, he gets everybody asks asks him if it's bearded bread. You know, back in the '90s, we used to have. Hey, check out our CD collection. This guy, look at what kind of surf rig you guys want to use? This how, this, oh, this this is a good record. This is a good record. <laughs> what all the fish are biting on this color right here, right now. It's kind of like a goldish. What are you using, Dustin? You using uh, orange? I'm using the Bruno rig. Oh, Bruno rig. So yep, that's it's orange. Got, and uh, yellow rig. and orange on it. Move, don't move. Oh, we got a we got a thief. We got a thief. Oh. He just stole a shrimp. <laughs> Man, alive! It's unbelievable. See this guy in person. I mean, he's on on YouTube. Hey, thanks a lot, guys, for coming along with that adventure. Uh, BS Surf Fishing Charters. We got Dustin Byrne. We're here at Janung's. 
It's been a heck of a week. Um, thanks for subscribing to the channel. Do appreciate it. Um, keep it reeling, guys. We'll see you on the next video. Look at these fish. Sail away, boys. Hey, hey, hey. These guys don't look alive to me, Mike. Do they look alive to you? <laughs> With me, sail,